Hello and welcome in this uh, video for this exercise given during the China Junior Math Olympiad. Uh, this exercise is this one. If x power 5 equal to 1, find the value of x over 1 plus x squared plus x squared over 1 plus x power 4 plus x cubed over 1 plus x power 6 plus x power 4 over 1 plus x power 8. So if you want to give a try, please pause the video. Otherwise, let's see the solution. First, we are going to focus on this. x power 5 equal to 1. Then we can deduct from that x is different from 0. Well, it could be interesting if we are going to divide by x. So, many ways to solve this uh, sum. So, and uh, I will present one way to solve that. This way, we're going to see terms one by one. Let's focus on term number two. We would like to see x power 5 in this term. So the idea is to multiply and to divide by x at the same time. We can do that because x is different from 0. So we end up with x cubed over x plus x power 5 and x power 5. We know this is 1. So this is x cubed over x plus 1. So let's talk about now term number 3. And we are going to use this by rule um, a power m plus m equal to a power m times a power n. So we are going to modify x power 6. And x power 6, this is x times x power 5. So we end up with x cubed over x plus 1. So at this stage, we can notice that term number 2 and term number 3 are the same. So let's talk now about term number 4, this one. This is exactly the same process. We would like to end up with x power 5, okay? So the idea is to multiply and to divide by the same quantity, x squared. So this is at the end, x power 6 over x squared plus x power 10. And we can end up, we can apply this rule and end up with x times x power 5 over x squared plus x power 5 times x power 5, and this is x over 1 plus x squared. So, term number 4 equal to term number 1. So, this sum can be written as 2 times x cubed over x plus 1, this is the value of term number 2 or term number 3, and plus 2 times x over 1 plus x squared, this is value of term number 1 or value of term number 4. So, now we've got a quantity, we've got a sum of two terms, we can reduce that to the common denominator, and if you distribute, we end up with x cubed plus x5 plus x plus x squared over x plus x cubed plus 1 plus x squared. We know that x power 5, this is 1, so we end up with 2 times 1 plus x plus x squared plus x cubed over 1 plus x plus x squared plus x cubed. So we've got the same quantity. So we can simplify numerator and denominator, and we end up with 2. So thanks for watching this video, and I hope to see you in uh, the next one.